Action. I think we can all agree you brought that on yourself. A bird flying through the building? Those crazy birds. Oh. Hey, talk to me. A new hand touches the beacon. Listen, hear me and obey. Nah. Foul darkness has seeped into my temple. A darkness that you will destroy. Probably not. Return my beacon to Mount Kill Creek. Eh, not right now, anyway. And I will make you the instrument of my cleansing light. Not really interested in the sword you're offering. Run, fox, run! That mud crab's gonna get ya. Oh no, the mud crab is chasing me. Oh, one of the people caught up with me. What am I gonna do with a mud crab on my heels? There used to be so many enemies underwater, but underwater is just a completely neglected area in Skyrim. Or the nymphs and those awesome nasty crab people from Morrowind. Slaughterfish are the only things, and they're not even that common or dangerous. Oblivion was also like that, though. There was only the slaughterfish. Hi. Halt. What is this? That's privileged information. Now, move along. Mm, there are people in there. Oh, there you are. Let's see if uh what's her face can catch up. All right. Everyone's here. You have an elven dagger. And you... your greatsword. Yay, impromptu slaughter fest! Kill the elves, kill the elves! Say that. Huh? I fired a blank. Go, zombie elf. Kill your companions and your friends. This is what deserves to happen. Now, how do I port the Overlord's armor into this game? Need a modder to do it. And then maybe the goblin totems from Oblivion to make minions? Well, that was fun. Why are these elves only using iron arrows? They should be using elven bows and elven arrows. Take that, and that. Well, that was exciting. 
No particular reason, I just felt like it. Okay, there's a dock here, and I guess I take it to sail to the big castle. That's it, out there to the north. We used to keep a boat around here to get down back. Why can't they animate any vehicles moving? Was that so difficult? Wheels rolling, boats splashing, wakes. Wakes are hard. You have no idea. No, we'll probably be attacking this place at some point with these gargoyles everywhere. Yes, you are an enemy. Yes, you are. Yeah. What? I wanted to thank you for getting me this far. But after we get in there, I'm going to go my own way for a while. Good. I think. I know your friends would probably want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. Maybe. Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. But I have to shout. That's my thing. Open the gate. Well, go on. <coughs> Psst, run into him. Lord Harkin's a great man. Best show him the proper respect. I'm no fan of the sun. It would be better than this. <laughs> the sun would be better than my home. I'd rather be incinerated. All aboard the railroad. Choo choo. How dare you trespass here? Wait. Serana? Is that truly you? I cannot believe my eyes. Huh? The? My lord, everyone! Serana has returned! I guess I'm expected. I can't believe it! I can't really... support what you're doing here. My long-lost daughter returns at last. I trust you have my Elder Scroll. After all these years, that's the first thing you ask me? Yes, I have the scroll. Of course I'm delighted to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words aloud? Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Now tell me, who this stranger you have brought into our hall? This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? Duh. You first. Very well. <laughs> I am Harkon, lord of this court. By now, my daughter will have told you what we are. You're an inclusive cannibal cult. <laughs> yes. Not quite. Though I can see how an outsider might arrive at that conclusion. No. We are vampires. Among the oldest and most powerful in Skyrim. For centuries we lived here, far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. He doesn't actually ask me for my name now. Yeah. I was about to suggest that very thing. Yes, you must certainly deserve a room. It's gonna be a jerk. 
There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. Don't you bite I me. I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Nope. Men will tremble at your approach and you will never fear death again. Eh? Then you will be prey, like all mortals. I will spare your life this once, but you will be banished from this hall. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! This is the power that I offer. Now, make your choice. A forced third-person camera that is really wonky and really weird animation. Nope. Nah. So be it. You are prey, like all mortals. I banish you. Could you at least banish me into a convenient location? No, out here, of course. Uh, Lydia? There you are. You just had to book it, right? Thanks for put lo putting me in a load screen right outside another load screen game. That's great, by the way. I like it. <sighs> okay, I am here in the middle of freaking nowhere. Markarth might have a wagon. Solitude does. It's kind of a hike, though. And they're just making me walk all over the place. Where do they want me to go now? Back to the Dawn Guard? I can't even scroll the map that far. Thanks, game. Run, Fox. Dead elves, as that should be. I would have done the same to the Thalmor embassy, but the door is magic locked with a super special key that you can't access until you're at a certain point in the plot. Oh. I banish you! Oh, no, it's Thalmor. I made an enemy of the Thalmor! How did I make an enemy of the Thalmor? I left no survivors. Magic. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna get you, get you, get you, get you. I go. Of course, he still has perfect aim. Lydia, there you are. Oh hi. No, you didn't. You're out of mana, punk. Take those robes and that execution order. I want to read it. 
The Justa cards are no big deal, but anyone who chucks spells is always super dangerous. They're still not using elven weapons, which I find humorous. One sec. Okay. How long has this been going? An hour. Horkers, we'll leave them alone. We will get close enough to this cave. Is it a pass? Nope, it's a burrow. Probably home to trolls. Hmm, on the path I'm on, I don't think I can get the solitude. But I can get to that, whatever that is. It's a boat. I've been to that boat. Didn't I start at that boat? No, I started at the Hall of the Vigilant. I think if you choose the shipwreck, you start in that boat. Or a boat similar. Shut up. Nobody likes you, Harker. So that's the bandit camp I passed through really quickly. Coast here. Uh, Dawnstar is really far away. Would probably wind up doing a wraparound. That would be faster. Too bad you can't learn teleport anymore. They got rid of it and just gave you fast travel. Which I don't really like. What are you doing in the trees, Horker? You belong at the coast. And I'm teasing you. Hi. It's wearing a mix and match of armor. Whoa, hey buddy. Why can't I cast spells and attack and move at the same time? The NPCs do all the time. Hey, Lydia. I need a meat shield. You are that meat shield. Oh, the worker can be the meat shield too. That works. Hmm, temporarily. Am I? Good. I'll be back more powerful than ever! That's what he was gonna say. A Lady Stormcloak soldier. My goodness. I do believe this is something from uh, the army mod that I have installed. How do you get to it? Escape mod configuration. Civil War overhaul, that's right. He was not an easy guy to kill. But as a bonus for all the adventuring around, I get tons of Nern root. In Sporegrass. Which I also think have invisibility as a trait. So... Excuse me. Thank you. It's 
spiky grass. Whatever. 